So I'm Bill Allison. I'm one of the hosts. I'm Berkeley's CTO, and our organizing group is Amy Neeser, um, Jason Christopher, and Anthony Suen. Uh, Amy and Jason are from Research IT in the Research Teaching and Learning uh, Department, and Anthony's in CDSS, the Computing, Data Science, and Society uh, new division at Berkeley. So um, without further ado, I'm going to turn it over to Amy, um, who is going to continue the welcome part of the meetup. Yes. Um, so for those of you who were here last month, you might recall we had a, a bit of a town hall session and a little activity. So we're going to use um, that same technology. So if folks could grab their devices and go to menti.com, got a couple questions to get us started. So M-E-N-T-I dot com. And when you get there, please enter the code 512591. And let us know who you are. So who's here tonight? It's a large percentage of other. I almost didn't put it in. So who are some of the others that clicked other? Well, this is Patrick. I put down other because you know, I'm not a private consultant, even though I am in the academic world still. Oh, cool. Glad you were yeah. here. One of the reasons that we started doing this survey was to actually understand the mix of people we were getting and our hope is has always been to get sort of the local community and startups and, and other along with academics and IT to sort of create the cross pollination and learning uh, from that wide group. Mm -hmm. And also students as well. Okay, great. So yeah, it looks like right about 51% IT and then split uh, with the uh, heavy representation from academic. Thank you, folks. Um, so this is a little quick one. So if you go to menti.com again, and then it's going to give you another code. Uh, so 512591. And how many of you are first time attendees versus been coming for a little while? Look at all these first time attendees, this is awesome. I like it. So it's looking like about half of you, this is your first time here, so very much welcome and thank you so much for being here. We're glad you came. Okay, and then one last question. Um, suggestions for topics for future meetups. So we're always looking for ideas. So again, go to menti.com and if you could enter 512591. So any topics that you'd like to hear about, um, maybe topics that we've covered that you'd like to hear more about, um, anything at all. These are good, I like this. Deep learning, machine learning. I think Internet of Things is a great suggestion. It looks like a few people are putting that in. Strategy, mm -hmm. big data storage, 
that's something we're thinking a lot about in research IT these days. Wow, y'all, this is a lot. This is amazing. Thank you. You are definitely making the lives of the planning committee a lot easier. So we will definitely look through all of these and um, we're listening. Yes, containers. These are fantastic ideas. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. And if you, know, if you think of other things, um, feel free to keep submitting. I like it. Looks like Kubernetes is like the most popular at this point. Cool. Well, thank you, folks. That was fun. Um, so yeah, let's just take a moment for um, any announcements. So um, one that I thought of is that we have a researching and troubled times event. Um, it's actually this Thursday from 11 until 1230. And um, research IT is working on this in conjunction with a whole lot of campus partners and um, Rick, you are one of the main planners. So if you want to hop on and say anything about this, um, I would invite you to. Oh, just I'll add that the other at this point, it's um, the library, the D lab, vice chancellor for research, the graduate division, um, academic innovation, American cultures. So it's, those are the sponsors, the people working on it. And the idea is to give researchers a floor. There have been a lot of meetings around responding to COVID and, and et cetera. But we're hoping to have a community exchange and that researchers could be talking to each other and with other people around listening, learning, um, and pointing to resources. Thank you, perfect. Um, so please join us for that if you are interested and help us spread the word. Um, the other thing I thought of is, um, we, like Bill said, we are starting to line up our programming for next month. So I'm really excited that we will have Larry Smar here um, next month and Chris Hoffman, do you want to say a couple words about that since you helped invite him? Oh, you caught me snacking. <laughs> <laughs> I was eating some chips. Sorry, to put Sorry you on the everyone. Spot. <laughs> yeah, I'm really excited that we'll be able to have Larry Smar from UC San Diego join us to talk about. Um, kind of the next steps on what we've been doing for several years on an NSF funded project called the Pacific Research Platform. Larry is one of the, the ongoing, you know, really kind of pioneers in research computing and in developing the Internet 2 and the next generation networking and support of research and, and education. So it'll be really exciting to bring him in and have him talk about where he thinks this goes next. Thank you. Thank you.